it's a lot better today than when I first went to basic training in October of 2001. I've been in for 21 years, all right, and, and counting. So with that said, when I went through training, it was one big open shower. So where the sinks were, the urinals and all that stuff, you would strip down to nothing and you, you're basically standing in line waiting to go take a shower. And like I said, back then it was a big open room with shower heads that wrapped around the room. And then we had poles in the middle of the shower room that had shower heads that wrapped around the pole. That was very uncomfortable, but just keep your eyes up. You know what I'm saying? But uh, in the beginning, it's going to be uncomfortable, but you get used to it. Kind of, sort of. But uh, all right, as used to as you possibly can, or you just don't notice as much towards the end. But uh, nowadays, outside of the reception battalion, that may still kind of be set up that way. Most basic training OSI and AIT sites have newer buildings that are designed differently, and y'all have individual stalls, and you can get undressed real quick because you're in PTs, right? So you're gonna get undressed real quick. You'll take your shower, wash the hot spots, and get out, get dressed, and, and go do your thing. But uh, I wouldn't worry about it too much, man. Uh, but I, I feel your concern, man. I had the same concern. Actually, I watched Full Metal Jacket. For the if you if you don't know what that is, go watch a movie. Showers is one thing, but what I was not looking forward to, and thank God it wasn't like that when I went there. But in this in the movie, they have toilets next to each other with no stall. So like you got to do your business, you got to wipe in front of everybody. That would have been insane. Luckily, it's not like that. So. You know, count your blessings. You got it better than I did when I went.